want to see our salvation? It's dragonfly. This is not our eternal salvation. It's just our momentary salvation. See how his hands are bent forward? He comes and he scoops up the bugs ahead of himself. Those red things are his eyes. See this one? He's got the scissor tail at the end. I don't remember if that's a male or a female. The scissor tail. Let's come over here a little closer to him. Oh look, now here's this one. And here's another one. See how he's black? And look at his tail. It's a club. So this is a club tail. Or club something. See how his eyes are black? It's cool how their head rotates. See it's black but he's got a yellow dot on his tail. Actually, there's three yellow dots. You see how one is pronounced, and the next one up is a little fainter, and then the next one's a little fainter than that? And let's check his wings. He has a little tiny black dot at the tip. Just one little black dot at the tip. Now, there's another black dot at that tip. A dragonfly will sit with his arms open, his wings open. He's got four wings, and they're all open. A damselfly will sit with them closed, up behind. Okay, so this is some kind of a black one. Okay, now here comes another one. This one over here is blue. Just saw him. Did he land? <laughs> See, that little blue one was a, dra a damselfly. Oh, I can't find him now. We'll just look at this brown one again. Oh, here's a, there's a mosquito. Oh, there they are. Look at this, three blue ones. Okay, let me see if I can zoom in on him when I find him again. There he is. They're very tiny, aren't they? Let's see if we can see his head. Where'd he go? Okay, Nancy, which blade was it? There's one going that way. There it is. Whoops. It's hard to focus. There we go. See how his body's very segmented? There's a few of them now. They're playing together. Oh, he dipped down in there. I don't think I'm going to be able to focus on him through there. Oh, here's another one right here.
See the reflection of his head? See his big eyes? Well, see how he's all segmented. But he's not a dragonfly, he's a damselfly. I believe. Oops, he's gone now. There he is. Oops. See his feet? You can't see his wings. If he even has wings. I don't know if he even has wings. He must have wings. Let me see if I can get in here closer to him. Oh, no. He's going to leave. Oh, look. Here's two of them mating. See how they... They mate to the back of the head. Oops. To the front of the head. Oh, they're sinking. See, here's his head. Oops. There's his head. So his tail, and I've lost them. Um, above that little branch there. Where am I looking? There, that's the branch. Okay, oops. So there's the blue one, but he's mating with a brown one. See, and it's at the back of the neck. So I guess this must be the blue would be the male and the brown would be the female. Now see how the, the wings are folded up together? That's a damselfly. Very interesting, eh? There's another one here, another blue one. There's several blue ones. There's one here. See how the wings are put back? They're not open. It's a difference in a damselfly and a dragonfly. There you go. That was your That was your natural history lesson for today. That's right. Entomology 101. I love entomology. There's a whole world out there just right beside us. I don't mind bugs as long as they don't bite me. Oh, that's the oven bird. You hear me say that all the time. You must know. You must be saying it to yourself. Oh, there's the oven bird. You should probably say that and then I say it too. Well, out of time. <laughs>